And this hit home for me because I have friends, families who are legitimately afraid to go outside because they fear for their safety. And NYPD Deputy Inspector Stuart Liu is doing something about it, leading the department's new anti-Asian hate crimes task force, introduced today by Chief of Detectives Rodney Harrison. This task force has been built and will continue to build trust and understanding between the NYPD and the, NY and the Asian New Yorkers. The task force put together in response to a rise in hate crime attacks on the Asian community in the wake of the coronavirus pandemic. A result of the harsh rhetoric surrounding the virus, which is believed to have originated in Wuhan, China, before spreading around the globe. Some Asian New Yorkers bearing the violent backlash of rhetoric gone wrong. 21 attacks in the city since March. Asian New Yorkers were attacked on trains, buses, parks, restaurants, and walking in their own neighborhoods. Harrison praised the Hate Crimes Task Force for clearing about 17 arrests, but admitted the reluctance on the part of some victims to follow up with the active investigations due to language barriers, cultural differences, or even fear of the police. This task force is formed of 25 Asian American detectives who all speak a different language, Asian language, whether it's Cantonese, Mandarin, Fukunese, Korean, Tagalog, and even beyond the pandemic, Chief Harrison says he'd like to see the unit become permanent with the goal of putting together similar specialized units to deal with similar crimes in our city's rich cultural community committed against other ethnicities. Tamson,